All right, now let's take a look at spaces, a uh, new feature here in Leopard. Um, to start with, I'm going to show you where to go in the system preferences to enable it. So you get to your system preferences, expose and spaces, spaces, and there is a box right there that says enable spaces. So go ahead and click that sucker, and you got it all turned on. Uh, you can have up to 16 uh, possible spaces, but for all intensive purposes, four is going to do it for you, or at least it does it for me. Now let's take a look at what spaces can do for you. Throw the icon down here on my dock. If I push it, I can see all four of my spaces here. Now there's the blank one I was just on, and then the other ones I have just like some web pages and being open for you. I can actually grab these and move them around from you know within this area. I can grab a space and move the space around as well, or I can just click it to go right to it. I can press control and then the arrow keys to hop around from space to space. Here let's uh, hop over to a website on this one so it looks different. Just slide up, slide over to my blank and slide down. That way it's just a way to make multitasking easier. If you have some window that's going to be open for a long time that you're not messing with, you can have that in a different screen. Maybe have a uh, iTunes open on a different screen so it's not you know, clogging up your desktop or anything. It's a nice little feature here. Uh, it's easy to use, and since I've started using it, I've been using it every day. Four spaces is enough for me. Uh, let me know how many is enough for you.